Whether you refer to them as weed eaters, weed whackers, or string trimmers, these landscaping tools are perfect for cutting grass and weeds along the edge of a flower bed, around a tree trunk, underneath a deck, and in other difficult-to-reach places. The most crucial factor to consider when selecting one is the power it provides, along with the tool's size and weight. And so in this video, we will cover some of the best weed eaters that you can get in 2023. Just because a weed whacker comes at a budget price, that doesn't mean you have to forego great features, as this corded electric offering from Greenworks proves. Suited to a small to medium yard, this string trimmer's head easily pivots for use as a trimmer or an edger, doubling its versatility. The handle telescopes from 40 inches to 50 inches, and the grip is also adjustable, so you can set the weed whacker to fit your own height, making it comfortable to use for lengthy gardening sessions. Its 5.5 amp motor runs smoothly and quietly, and has enough power to quickly cut through grass and non-woody weeds. At only 7 pounds, this is a reasonably lightweight string trimmer, so it won't wear you down before the job is through. Go cordless with a lightweight string trimmer that's designed to take care of small to medium yards. The curved shaft makes it easy to maneuver around shrubs, rocks, and tree trunks, and the handle is ergonomically designed for a comfortable grip. Plus, weighing a mere 4 pounds, this is a weed eater that shouldn't tire you out. It's powered by an 18-volt battery that recharges in an hour and runs for anywhere from 8 to 15 minutes per charge, depending on how you use it. And with a simple push of a button, you can switch the head's orientation. Use it horizontally for trimming and vertically for edging. This weed whacker comes with an 18-volt battery that can be used in other 18V Rayobi tools, as well as a charger. Note that it is not compatible with Rayobi's expanded attachments, however. Another great choice would be this professional quality cordless string trimmer that also has the kind of power and runtime you'd expect from a gas weed eater. It has enough power to clear through thick brush, overgrown grass, and heavy weeds, reaching full throttle in less than a second and maintaining power without bogging down. It is designed for good balance, making it easy to carry and comfortable to use, even on lengthy yard tasks. A variable speed trigger lets you go faster when you need more power, or slow things down when you want to extend battery runtime as much as possible. And when the string gets short during use, just bump the trimmer against the ground to advance more strain. Not everyone needs a weed eater with this kind of power and at this price point, but for those who do, it's hard to beat this offering from Milwaukee. If you have a large area of brush, overgrown grass, or woody weeds to clear, then you'll appreciate the extra power of a gas weed eater like this offering from Echo. The Echo's starting system makes it much easier to start up this weed eater than most others, and once powered on, this sturdy beast chews steadily through just about anything you ask it to. The handles are padded and ergonomically shaped for comfort, and are also designed to greatly reduce the amount of vibration that reaches your hands and arms. When the string runs out, the Echo Speed Feed system requires no tools and takes only seconds to reload, no frustrating fuss or bother. With a 17-inch cutting swath, you can work your way across the lawn quickly. Should you need even more powerful cutting action, Echo sells a separate conversion kit that lets you swap out the string head for a metal-bladed head that easily cuts through thick underbrush and overgrown weeds. Be aware that this weed eater is quite loud and does emit gas fumes, as is typical for gas-powered tools. If you want the power of a gas weed eater but the convenience of a battery-powered tool, then this 4-volt offering from Ryobi is the answer. It includes a brushless motor for a longer life with less required maintenance and an adjustable handle so you can position it comfortably for your height. It also has variable speed controls, so you can go faster when you need extra power for tough weeds or brush, and slow the tool down to extend the battery runtime when merely cutting small weeds and grass. Plus, it has an adjustable cutting width, with a minimum of 13 inches and a maximum of 15 inches. It also comes with a set of serrated plastic blades, which can be fitted into the tool's head in place of string. Use the blades for cutting tougher brush and weeds. While not nearly as strong as metal blades, these do a good job on softer weeds and grasses, but they aren't sturdy enough for woody weeds. 
The Weed Whacker comes with one Ryobite lithium-ion 4 volt battery and charger, which are compatible with any other Ryobite tool using a 4 volt battery. Depending on conditions, you can get up to 1 hour and 10 minutes of runtime from the battery before needing to recharge. And there you have it. If this video helped you out in any way, please like the video. And if you want more videos like this one, subscribe.